Hello there ladies and gentlemen, my name is Chronic Gamer and in this video I hope to give people who don't really know what Guild Wars 2 PvP is all about at least a vague idea. So let's start with the basics. Guild Wars 2 PvP for the most part consists of 5v5 matches based on the capture point game mode. There are a couple of other modes played and some new ones still to come, but most of the competitive stuff happens in this one. Maps are constructed around the idea of having three capture points which reward points to the team that has captured them. Points can be capped by one of the two teams, or be neutral as well, in which case neither team gets points. This basic system is applied on a variety of different maps, which of course feature different terrain. In addition to that, every map has a unique secondary mechanic. This can vary from a guild lord which rewards points when killed to a trebuchet that deals a considerable amount of damage to your enemies. The way the maps are designed leads to very dynamic team fights in which movement across the map as well as coordination and communication of the team members is at least as if not more important than individual skill. The combat system of Guild Wars 2 adds to this fluidity. But what's so special about it? Well, a large amount of the skills in Guild Wars 2 use ground targeting, which means you can simply move out of the way of a lot of attacks. Almost all abilities can be used while moving, so movement in general is a key element of the game. Every class in the game can also dodge a certain amount, which you can use to avoid the most dangerous attacks of your enemies with certainty, if you are able to identify them. Another mechanic is the down state. Once your health bar reaches its inevitable end, you will not simply die. You have, let's call it, a second chance. Once in down state, you have two options of returning to the land of the living. Either your teammates assist you, in other words resurrect you, or you'll manage to kill an enemy, which will result in you rallying. But your enemies can also finish you off. Everyone in a team can resurrect allies as well as finish enemies. These are two core mechanics and most of the time demand a certain amount of teamwork to accomplish. And when everything comes together, it can lead to exciting matches for yourself, or also in a variety of tournaments. Trying to knock back Goldfie, but it's not going to be enough. It actually backfired, and Mortigar now gets taken down. So Blue Team's going to flip this around. They might take the, the bottom buff down. More reinforcements piling in for them now. Sandy Kitten just got down here. Wow, they turned this around. Nice. Freilina, we're just going to drop in with Freilina here. we got three guards in the mid. Oh, we do see some treb support there. Four casts. That's a really good move there by Misha. There's three people in the mid as well. Maybe Blue can get to these side points. He's going to go for that ninja. Ooh, who's going to get it? Oh, Blue they didn't it. get it. Nice. Nine, if Red get this kill, they will indeed win it. They've got two there on the point now against Varnay. Oh, no, Blue got it. Four nine, the eight. Oh. Wow, what a wonderful job. You need to know that we did have Shad take the lead, flipping this around. Not by much, but they are the lead now with those two captors. This game is not over. Uh, team Puggy is, will is willing and able to take out this Chieftain and they're going to do that. They're going to come back in this game as hard as possible. They need that staff up for those team fights. Here comes that kill. There it is. It's only 20 points behind. That oh bus! Back. The bus! Let's go, go to Gengar. He's going to fierce mining into the corner. Louis Dotto wailing away. Here comes the plus column as well with Misha's here to try and steal. It's only a matter of time if Lucas can hard gets They do! The blue team wins this hoop game. Oh my god! Der Kerl wird es nicht mehr sein, dafür ist er schon zu kurzfristig. Tequaza könnte hier noch gehen und das wird dann nur ein weiterer Punkt für das rote Team. Damit haben sie... Nein, sie haben den Stomp noch nicht hinbekommen. Und jetzt wird ein Punkt... Oh, da hat noch oh, oh. ist getickt, das ist ein Dankeschön. If this little introduction has piqued your interest and you want to check it out for yourself, then you might want to have a look at my upcoming PvP Guide Series. It's going to be a step-by-step -step guide in which I hope to enable complete beginners in either Guild Wars 2 or just the PvP part of the game to start their PvP journey, give a few handy tips and tricks wherever I can, and also introduce you to the PvP scene surrounding the game. 
As soon as the first part is up, you'll find an annotation somewhere on the screen right now. But that's it for this video. My name has been Chronic Gamer, and I'll see you next time.